Hello everyone, we are live here from Plano, Texas, here for the DSTHL playoffs. This is the semi-final series. It'll be first to two games to win, best out of three, we'll move on to the finals. And the finals will be the exact same kind of series. First to two, best out of three. This is a, up against the Texas Warriors, based out of Richardson, Texas. I believe the Dallas Stars are not allowed to play since I think they're an 0-2 AAA team. This is um, a double zero, double A. Anyway, now time for game one of this series. The winner will play soft fight against Houston or McKinney. And we are now underway here in this first period. 15 minute periods. Off we go. Hello everyone and welcome to this broadcast. I'm Tyler Presley. With me here is my good friend, Hamis Radia. How you doing, buddy? Tyler, it's the playoffs. I'm, I'm so excited, I'm telling you. I mean, you and I saw the game back on the other end against uh, Houston and McKinney. Last time we checked, it was still 0-0, like three minutes left in the third period. Likely, it'll, likely it's probably gonna go to overtime. But here, on the world rink, off we go. How am I seriously going to say something? Well, Tyler, I think one team will really want to have to try to... I think both sides have some room for improvement. This is to apply what they've learned since that last encounter. Currently, it's Ellis playing back to his defense. Back over to him. Ellis has some room on the right side to the center. Couldn't hang on to the puck. He could have had a chance, I think. A point. Now toward the corner. Hang was trying to hang on to it, but is now back behind the net. Hang was back with it. Now loose to the corner. Warriors looking to get it out. Green keeping it in. Off his stick and wide. Now on the corner. Behind the net, still loose. Now over to the other corner. Side keeping it away. Now the Warriors have it. That was the only chance to stop the rush there, and they did. Off the glass there. Here's starting goalie for this game is number 41, Evan Riddle. Ty, I think you and I are both hoping that he does a lot better than he did that last game we called. I'm pretty sure. Murray, not two. Well, in ten, I believe there for, I want to say that was Ellis, but he didn't get a hold of it. I oh, sorry, that was Bittner, my bad. Here is, I believe that's Fowler, off of Bittner's stick, and tipped into the zone, no ice. There we go. It's a board battle here. And we have a delayed penalty coming up here. Probably for a rough. It is a rough. We have a roughing call here. Tyler, if you're too physical and do it wrong, you could end up with a roughing call. Yeah, that's probably something that you probably didn't intend to do. I don't know. We didn't entirely, we didn't really entirely see it, but some roughing penalties are not intentional. But intentions don't matter once you end up in the penalty box. Once you're sitting down, you're sitting down. And it's now time for the team press and sports power play. It's our first play. For, whoa, almost, but not enough. Our first power play of this game. Now, yeah? thank you for joining us here on the T Press Sports Network. There's a shot, ooh, just off of Riddle's blocker there. Well, like I say, we can officially say he's doing better. He made it safe. Well, we might have to make a lot more later. There's another shot saved by Riddle, trying to poke away at it. Riddle pounces on the puck. And 
so the Warriors will make a line change. And the face-off here is won by the Warriors. Now at the corner. Off a sick, and it's out of the zone. Neil going off with it. Good poke check there by the defense. That was vital. Entire, when it comes to poke checks like that, you can never underestimate the importance of a key poke check like that. It can mean a big payoff at the other end. And that puck went off, off a player in the Penguins bench and out of play. And this face-off is won by Texas. There's a shot stay made, and they're trying to wrap it around if they can. Texas is trying to get something going, but you know, excuse me. But they couldn't hang on for too long, but another man picks it up at the, near the corner on the side. It's a battle here. The Warriors emerge off the battle. There's a shot, they score! That was a great way to move around the goaltender like that. Nice way to get the shot off. He was right up on the goaltender. Shooters land. I guess in this case, he really manufactured the opportunity and made it work. And he just manufactured a nice goal. The Warriors now have the one goal lead here in the first period. They have the chance now to expand on that. Got it right where they want it to be. The penalty is over, but the clock is still ticking down, but it's five on five. The corner, there's a chance, just missed. He thought he had it too. That shot missed as well. Toward the side. Loose puck. The defense now has the puck. Pass Riddle there. Oh. Ellis. Fowler now in the corner. Losing time and space. Now it goes to Ellis at center. Ellis, he gains his own. Good toe drag there, couldn't get past the other defenseman. And Texas takes it back. Couldn't get it out there. Oh, what a hit! Currently it's Dallas now with it, Schaefer couldn't hold on. Looks like it'll be a delayed penalty coming up here. Not sure who it's against though. They're calling another roughing penalty. I think they're going to call it against Texas. <clears throat> well, you can tell just by the reaction, that must have been a pretty dreadful hit. I mean, I didn't see it. Did you? Well, I can just tell by listening. And this face off. Saying goodbye, Dallas. Currently now on the power play, trying to try to tie the game if they can. Can a little bit. There we go. Penguins at the point. Here's the side. So the side shoots. Good stop there. And we'll hold on. Eight twenty-four to go in this first period of play. Score is one nothing in favor of the Warriors. It's a minute thirty-three left in the penalty. Rushing back behind his goal. Desai. I'm going to start the offense from the defense. Philo 
Here's a good stick in with Philo. Still with it, behind the net. Still holding on to it, looking to get it off his stick. There it goes, Decide the point. Shoots, off something, and then to get through. Cuts in at the point by the side. Finds his teammate, rushing. So I believe that's Philo. And the Warriors get it away. Gets tripped from behind. No call, oh excuse me, there's a call. And it's, never mind, tripping penalty. I didn't see the arm until I made that that comment, so I was wrong there. My bad. The whistle is blowing a tripping call. Let's take another look. Oh yeah, he got him good on that one. That really got the attention of the officials. For sure, partner. And you can get hurt on the trip. These guys wear a lot of pads, but they're still human. And this face-off taken by the Warriors on the two-man disadvantage. The side waiting, he shoots, didn't get through. I think he needs to place the puck a little bit better, so just shoot it. There's a one-timer, just missed the net, rebound! He's made a count on the 5 on 3. But just inches away from making a great pad save. They're off the rebound, but he just couldn't get there. Yeah, Barney, you're telling me those loose, those loose puck situations are always scary in front of the net. This play shows why. Definitely scary. That is, if you're on defense, or the goalie, or the coach for that matter. Five on four now, one of the penalties over. We're all knotted up at one goal apiece here in the middle of the first period. 7.06 to go in the first. Penguins have it at the point. On the five on four, on the power play. There's a shot, redirected, just missed the net. Ellis, down to the side. The side, he shoots. That was redirected wide. And the net got knocked off the moorings. Face-off coming up in the neutral zone. <clears throat> this draw taken by Dallas. The side off the boards. Philo couldn't dump it there. He tried though. Finds a Penguins teammate. Texas gets that one back and they'll clear it down. Kill off some time on the five on four. The side with it behind his goal. Who's it to? It finds rushing. Rushing out of Philo. In on side. Philo drop pass to Isa. Now on the corner, being battled for it, it goes around the back. The side on the end of it. He kept it in. Pass to the side. Waiting. Pass over to the right side. Didn't find the man that he wanted to give it to. Isa. Good cut out there by the Warriors, and they're coming back on the penalty kill. 12 seconds to go in the penalty. It's up in the air. Finds Riddle's glove. He'll hold on to that one. We'll have a face off. So I don't think I regret that. Sometimes you just want to keep it in your glove just to be safe. Better safe than sorry. Nine seconds to go in this. Power play for the Penguins, 5.47 to go in the first period, and it's tied at one right now. Finds a man while he's on his knees there. That was a good pass. Couldn't hold on to it though. Now it's Dallas. Penalty is now over. We're back to five aside. Brought down by Murray. Murray still with it. And he'll dump it, they'll chase. Almost 
almost found someone in front, but just couldn't. Couldn't keep it in. He just let it go. What happened? Apparently it's Dallas in their own zone. Five minutes to go in this first period. It's being battled for back behind the net. Can't seem to get it moved. Now it gets moved and the Warriors emerge off the battle. The corner. Warriors trying to go up to the challenge there. Now it's Murray is keeping it in and he'll thumb it down to the corner from the point. He kept that one in. Finds it, man. There's a shot into the glove and he'll hold on. I think I'm hearing that the game it's the game game one between uh, Houston and McKinney is in a shootout nothing between them so far it's zero zero no goals at all I believe okay new video Andre's gonna hang on to it Texas paying it back up but it's offside all right, I've said it many times before and I'll say it again you have to think that the defense is gonna be really size of relief after that one <laughs> You have a point, Hamas. You have a point. Dallas wins the draw there. Touch the center ice. Dallas takes it back. Now it's loose. Warriors take it. And they get it dumped down. They'll chase. Almost there. And a little bit dangerously there, but they got the job done. Now it's currently being battled for back behind the net. Neil emerges off the battle. Neil finding man, hands it off to Ellis. Ellis, still with it. Looking to find someone to give it to. I, I believe that's Bernier back there. Here's Neil in the corner <coughs> to Green at the point. Green shooting off a piece of equipment there and up over the glass into the upper netting and out of play. Face-off will take place in the neutral zone. <clears throat> Penguins win the draw in their attacking zone now. Isa going to try and pass it to somebody, but it goes to Sue in a ward battle. And the Warriors emerge off the battle. Warriors with it. Top of the circle, shoot, save me by Riddle, up in the air. They're trying to bring it down. No stick, touched it. Texas with it, there. One just missed. Stick going inside there. Here's Green. I'm gonna get it out. Warriors trying to pick it back up. The man lost his stick. I'll tell you, can't do anything without a stick. There's the shot, point blank. What a stop by Riddle. Well, he's playing better than he did before. And this face off is taken by initially Dallas. Kept in by the Warriors. Almost found someone down there. It's intended for Schaefer. And I'll probably have to try that again as it's an icing call. 2.15 to go in this first period. And there's nothing between these two right now. Still tied at one. Both goals were power play goals. Warriors scoring a 4-4 four and, four, and the Penguins scoring a... Sorry, not 4-4, four 5-4. Four, and, four, and the Penguins scoring a 5-3. Oh, swept away there. Good 
work there. Warriors have a chance. That shot was blocked and it goes to the corner. Warriors pick it up. That was good. That was a good cut out there. And here comes Murray. Has a chance. There's a shot just over the top. Big opportunity missed there, Tyler. That was a good chance. To the left side. Shooting. Say May. Rebound developing. He's got no one to help him with right now. Another chance develops. That was a good blocker save. And the Warriors goalie hangs on. Okay, cool. We just received word that the North Stars won on the other end in a shootout. So they'll take game one. So McKinney will take game one, as we said there, just to keep you all updated on that. If you want to check out what the schedule looks like, I'll post a link in the description. Now, there will be scores in there as well, so if you don't want to spoil yourself, then don't click on it. <laughs> I can respect the idea of no spoilers. Jekker tried to get on that one, but couldn't. Or, sorry, not Jekker, Murray. Now it's the Warriors with a chance. That one just went off a brittle stick and up into the upper netting and out of play. This face off will be to Riddle's left side, our right side of the net. Just under a minute to go in this first period. It's still one to one. Finds a man. Here's Ellis at center. Ellis trying to get around the defensive wall there, but I think he could, but finds a teammate. High slot, shooting, save made, and the rebound is swept away. Target there. Jacker chipping at that one. Couldn't get enough on it to get it out. Jacker off the boards there. Ooh, good keep there. Finds a man. Here's Ellis. A man behind him. Trying to dump it. Penguins need to get set up now. Warriors will line change. Six seconds to go in the first period. He's got a chance. Shoots one, but not enough. And that'll do it for your first period of play. Your score after one is Texas Warriors one, Dallas Penguins one. Well, Ty, we've seen what both of these teams can do so far. I do think both can do a little bit more. Uh, we'll see what happens. It's anyone's game. We'll see you guys in the second period. Well, for now, speed now. Thanks, John. Both teams seem to feel ready to go to start out the second period of play. It's 1-1 right now. Score is tied. Any goal can, the next goal put whatever team that scores it in the driving seat of this match. It's the second period and off we go. The Warriors win the opening draw to start off the second. Shot missed. Currently it's Dallas with it in their own zone right now. Both sides will really want to try and pull ahead here. He's throwing his weight there and it's going to be, I think, a penalty coming up. On a two and ten for a check from behind. And it looks like it will be. 
like it'll be Ian Struck is back out there. He'll serve the two minutes. Nas is there. No one, no sick hit that one, but it's Warriors off the draw. They were successful in their last power play. Can they do it again? We'll find out. There's a shot. Just off a of sick there, and it finds Riddle. This face-off here is won by the Warriors in their attacking zone on the power play. Turned away by Riddle, they're up off the glass. Now loose in the corner. Warriors trying to hang on to it. Find a man. There's a, ooh, I think he tried to, either he tried to put it on net or put it to the other corner to create some time and space. There's a shot, I think he was gonna miss, it went off Riddle's blocker there. He went to the blocker save. Chance developing here, good defensive pressure. Couldn't keep it in. Now the Warriors with it. Good pass. Hope checked, I believe. Loose in the corner. Try to work it to the front. That one was stopped, and the Penguins ice it down to kill off some time on the penalty. 44 seconds to go in the 5 on 4. 13 or 6 right now in the second period. That's how much time is remaining in the second, I should clarify. It's not like soccer. Okay. Good keep in there by the Warriors. And now it escapes the zone. And now the Warriors in their defensive zone. Arm is up and it's icing. Go back to the other end for a face-off. We're gonna throw it down to our ringside reporter, John. He's got some information for us. John, take it away. Thank you, Tyler. Well, while they were in the dressing room, or excuse me, not the dressing room. This isn't the Taj. While they were at the bench, I had a chance to speak to the head coach of the Warriors. He told me you could look at it a tie in either a positive or a negative view. He tends to look at it in a positive light. We're one goal away from taking control. He then told me that uh, taking penalties can be the Achilles heel for any team, especially when they, excuse me, even when they rear their ugly heads. He's happy they haven't done that a whole lot in this game so far compared to their opponents. We'll see if his words translate to the ice. That's all I have for now. Let's send it back upstairs to you two in the booth. Thank you, John. Informative as always on that one. Oh. In the corner, Penguins with it. Penalty is over, I should have said. Some appeals for a bench miner there, they're not gonna get it. Warriors have the puck. Loose puck at the slot, shot, save made. Puck now in the corner. Riddle trying to get his stick back, it's being battled for, they're buying him time. He has his stick back now and the Penguins have it back behind their net. Couldn't keep it in. It's a foot race to the puck. Penguins almost had a chance there as Shrunk barely got a stick to it. Didn't get all of it though. Here's a chance by Bernier. Couldn't put it away. Kept in at the point. Ellis shooting off the blocker. Loose. Warriors couldn't keep it, excuse me, couldn't get it out. Penguins with it. Ellis. Intended for Bernier there, couldn't hang on to it. Good defensive pressure. Whoa, that almost hit me. But it's out of play. We'll have a face off coming up in the circle. At least I felt like that almost hit me. It got it, it got pretty close. Oh, 
However, Bernier will take this face off. Good. Went off the draw there and they clear it down, but it'll be icing. It's five on five. In case they haven't remembered. All the penalties have been in, have, have, have expired. 10.38 to go in this second period of play. It's still deadlocked at one. Warriors with it at center. Gains the zone. Trying to find a man. Penguins trying to take it away. Puck escapes the zone. And it's going to be a penalty coming up. Another one. There's a check from behind. It'll be 2 and 10. Time will see how dirty this game gets. That's the second 2 and 10 we've seen in this game. Well, uh, he's going to sit for at most 12 minutes. Because the 10 minutes don't start until the penalty is expired. Ten twenty to go in this second period of play. Two minutes on the clock. Five on four. Penguins power play coming up. And the winner of this draw, I believe, was Texas initially. Currently, the Penguins have it back behind their net, looking to get some attacking going if they can. Oh, dangerous pass there! Better be lucky that his opponent didn't get a stick on that. The corner right now. Let's take him down there. It's a battle. Penguins emerge. Gonna move around. Takes a shot. Save made up in the air. Just past the post. Penguins keep it in. The center was over quarter of the way through. There's a shot. He The vast majority of these goals have been scored on a power play. Sorry, not vast, but just the majority. He had all eyes for goal on that one. He made that one count. Top right the whole way. And that's such a difficult area as a goalie to protect. I mean, you have to make a choice. You can't cover everything. And that's why any score with assault, that should be the first place they should be looking for at the point when they get the chance. He did there. The Penguins have taken the lead here and are now in the driving seat of this match. The question is for them, they had to stay in that driving seat up until the final horn. Bender finds a man. Good stop. Miss Bittner getting set to take this face off. Face off won by Bittner. There's a shot. Didn't get through traffic in front. Warriors trying to get it away. And they get it away now. No ice. It's a stoppage of play here. Not sure what the call is. Doesn't seem like a penalty, I don't think. No, it's not. It's probably just a late icing call. Or it might have just been a touch icing call, but no, it's, uh, but touch-up icing was ruled off a, a, a couple of years ago, as far as I'm concerned. Jecker, there's a shot, off, jumped off the stanchion there, to the corner. Warriors with it. It's loose. Teammate finds it. Trying to hang on to it. The defense now has the puck. Schaefer redirects it out of the zone. To Schaefer, intended for him, couldn't hang on to it. Icing is called, couldn't get a stick on it. A 
8.26 to go in this second period of play. It's 2-1 to one in favor of the Penguins. And this draw is won by the Warriors. It's a board battle now. Penguins trying to get it away from the front of the net. From the slot, that is. Penguins get it out of the zone. Warriors have it in the defensive end. Get it out. Warriors have it, they gain the zone. There's a shot on target, saved by Riddle. Pulls it back to him and he'll hold on to the puck. Face off coming up. Uh, I, was, I didn't see Struck the last game or the game before that. But now I think the Penguins have a full roster as he's back now. Not sure what he was injured from or anything like that. I can ask around. But he is back out there and I believe, yeah, I don't see anyone who's injured out there on the Penguins bench. Either that or they're not here. When I mean here, I mean on the bench. <laughs> he's, he's back behind the net. Neil trying to get a stick to it. It's Bernier to Neil. Now, point down to the corner. Bernier to Neil. Couldn't get a shot out. There's a, a little bit of a shot there by Neil. He tried, but just couldn't. There's Ellis. Ellis, top of the circle, moving through. He shoots, redirected, and wide. Good cut out there. Warriors getting a dump, they'll chase. Here comes Ellis. Ellis, good toe drag move. Couldn't get through, it'll be a tripping penalty coming up. There's the touch up. Late penalty. I'm sorry, not a trip, but a hook. I got confused between those two. Tyler, this only hurts them. The last time they were on the penalty kill, they couldn't keep it away out of their net. They have to do that this time and kill off the penalty. That's the least they can do for right now. If anything else, try and get a, sh a short hand goal if they can. Here's Murray. Currently, it's on the Penguins power play. They were successful there last time. Can they do it again? We'll find out. 520 to go in the, sorry, 620, my bad. I misread that number. He's with it at center. Couldn't move through on his own. Behind the net. Just over a quarter of the way through the penalty. Butler. To the center. Schaefer. No, sorry, that's Isa. My bad. Isa. Intended there for the teammate. There's a shot. He falls! Did it again? You kidding me? That's uh, that, he didn't put it up and over, just but he put it right over the pad. That's a sweet spot if you're a shooter. He'll be happy to take that one with him into this game. It's another power play goal for the Penguins. He might need that one later. You never know. Penguins have extended their lead here in the middle of the second period. It's three to one. Kept in at the point. Now it's out of the zone. Warriors trying to pick it up. I'll have to go to a new video here in just a moment. Puck back around the net. I'll do a new video now. All right, new video. It is now in the corner being battled for. Penguins have it now. Finds a man at center. Couldn't move through the defenseman. <clears throat> Letting it go. No one on the end of that stretch pass attempt. It'll be icing. And the uh, player is down.
Hopefully he's okay. He's trying to get up. He might have just got the wind knocked out of him, I think. Up now. And he'll go back to the bench. Hopefully, he will make a quick recovery. Well, Tyler, I said, I said it before, I'll say it again. It doesn't matter whose side you're on, you don't want anyone to get hurt. Well, that's for sure. I mean, any intent to injure is frowned upon. Especially with USA Hockey. Okay, adjusting my level here. That looks pretty good. And here we go. Face off with the Circle of the Warriors attacking zone. There's a shot off the pad. They poke away at it. The net is dislodged. What is the call? Tensions fuming. Another face off coming up in the circle, I believe. The referees have never made, have not made their way out of the zone. So they'll just readjust the net. Oh, we'll go to the neutral zone for a face-off. Still 3-1. 441 to go left, or to, to go left. 441 left in the second period of play. Yeah, still three, for, still three to one. Penguins ahead. At home. Isa at center, looking to find someone, finds the defensive man, so the other defensive man. That pass didn't find any teammate of theirs. Looks like it's a battle coming up here, possibly. Penguins trying to pick it back up, they keep it in at the point. Redirected there, couldn't put it away. They try to work it to the front. Brought down. Isa. Isa moving in. Trying to go short side, net is dislodged once again. The other one this time. And when the net gets moved out the post like that, that just means there's a lot of physical contact down in front of the net. Face off in the neutral zone coming up. Robert Bernier getting set to take the face off, and he wins the face off for his team. And Penguins defense is real playing it. Four minutes left, so now down to 3.55 left in the second period. <laughs> Bless you! Thank you. Alexander getting rid of that one. Or that might have been Jacker, I'm not sure. No, that's Alexander. Neil, I believe. Turned over. Warriors with a chance. That shot didn't really go anywhere where they wanted to. Penguins picking it back up. And they get it out of the defensive zone. Puck is loose. Going to retreat back to his net. Here's Neil in the corner. Bernier behind the net. Bernier, that one didn't find anyone. Good pressure there by the Warriors defense. <coughs> now back behind the net, loose. Warriors are going to get rid of it. Pops off the stanchion there. And they get rid of it. Warriors with it at center. Past the blue line. Along the right side, trying to find someone to give it to. It's back behind the net. Now to the other corner. He still has it. Passes it to the point. There's a, there's a pass there, but he didn't find anyone. Penguins are going to get it out. Finds a man. It's at center. Here's Ellis. Good poke check there. Tyler, you love you love plays. Excuse me. You love breaking up plays like that as a defenseman, especially when you can turn those me, turn those same defensive opportunities into offensive ones. And the Warriors have the puck. Now it's loose. In the corner, Warriors trying to find a man open. Find a man at the point. Take it down to the side. Penguins get it out. Boy, playing sweeper keeper. Oh, 
Good turnover, dude. Good pick out there. Oh, good turn right. Picked off the pass there. Now it's the Warriors. Just under two minutes to go in the period. Arm is up, and it will be an icing call. Puck barely made it there. I'm not sure why the clock is still ticking. There we go. Probably has to put a couple of seconds up on the clock, I think. Unless they didn't know that, I don't know. Maybe the clock didn't tick. As it says right now, it's a minute 36 left. That could change though, I'm not sure. And the face off, won by the Warriors. That shot was redirected, didn't get through, traffic in front. Minute 30 left in the period. There's a shot off the pad. Rebound chance developing. The defense get it away. They have it right now. Puck is loose now. It's on the corner. Warriors take it at center. The corner Warriors with it. They're still battling for it. One versus one. One minute to go in the second period. It's still 3-1 in favor of the Penguins. Couldn't get a stick on it. Couldn't get it out. Checker trying to get it out. He gets it out now. Warriors looking to get set up again. Off his stick there. Delayed offside. Penguins have some time. Finds a man. Couldn't hang on to it. Warriors take it back. Find a man. They're working to the front. And the man goes into the goal, but not the puck. The neck is knocked off the post again. I'll well, tell you, don't mind that. You don't mind having a little putting together. That's not a bad effort. Thirty-one point eight seconds to go in the second period of play. Score is still three to one in favor of Dallas. Some players over there going to the bench. We'll resume play here once again. Face off to the right of Riddle, our left side of the net. Ice is looking to get it out. He escapes his own. Delayed offside. Warriors take it back. Off the boards, it goes to Struck. Struck tried, oh, we are saying he thought he was going to shoot, but he tried to move around, but failed in his effort to do so. Puck stays in the confines of the ring. Now it's out of the confines of the ring and out of play. Four point eight seconds to go in the second period, and now pretty much it for your second period of play. Your score after two is Texas Warriors one, Dallas Penguins three. Well, Ty, the Penguins have been able to work up a little bit of momentum here, but you don't, you can't neglect the fact that the Warriors have been knocking on the door, especially late in that second period. It's anyone's game still. I mean. As long as the Penguins can play strong defensively, they should be fine and play a step ahead. Thank you for your comments on that one. How much we will see you guys in the third period? We'll step out. All right, John. Thank you for that report. I think we're the truth. The Penguins seem to look pretty satisfied going out into the third period up by two. It's always easier to play ahead than from behind. It's the third period, and we're now underway. The winner of this game will take the lead in the series one to nothing. You need two games to win in this series to move on to the finals. And in the finals, again, two games to win. The gadgets, off we go. This really down there. Behind the net and out of the corner. 
Finds an, an opponent there. Warriors with the puck. Didn't find anyone in the front. Gonna hang on to it. The side. He, good game for him. Two goals in this one for him. I'll be honest, I've kind of missed his goals from the point. Good to see him pull off a couple more. That's for sure. I'm not sure if he worked on them all in practice or not, but he's made them count, that's for sure. Currently, the Panthers are trying to get it out, and it escapes the zone. Puck won't make it for an icing call. He lost his foot in there. Finds the teammate at the corner. The Psy plays it down to the corner. We're going to buy some time and space. In the corner. There's a one-timer just missed the net. And they went up over the glass and out of play. Well, Tyler, that was ambitious, but couldn't put it on target. There. All right. We'll make sure I don't trip over anything back behind me because my little gadgets are behind me. There's a shot saved off the pad there, and the Warriors get it cleared down. Arm is up, icing is called. We're gonna throw it down now to ice level. John follows that ring side with a report on the game. Huh? Uh, John, what's the scoop? Thank you guys. Well, while they were at the bench, I had a chance to speak to the head coach of the Penguins. Having the lead was nice, he claimed, but it wasn't good enough. If they wanted to go home, if they wanted to really finish this one happy, there's still work to, to be done. With it being the playoffs, he was hoping that his guys knew by now, especially how to properly close the game out. I then asked if there's anything that anything else you want to talk about. He didn't hesitate. Four checking, he said. I think we're doing pretty well with it, but we need to keep it up more because if we're going to advance to the finals, if that's what we're planning to do, if we do do that, we're going to have to up the pressure a lot. He told me. We'll see if his words translate to the ice. Now back to you to the booth. Thank you, John, for that report. Very informative. Like I said before, let us know if you hear anything else. Thank you. Shot redirected there up off the top of the glass. Warriors with it in the corner. There have been quite a number of bodies falling. I'm not sure why it is. Well, some of it's hits, some of them, I guess, losing their just general foot loss, I guess. Schaefer has a chance if he can try and pull around. There's a shot on goal. Save made. He'll play the puck. Back behind the net. Out to the corner. It's a battle here. 2v1. And the, the Penguins actually were from that one initially. And now the Warriors take it away. At center. Gains his own. Shoots. Just missed. Kept it in. Good block shot there by, I believe that was Alexander. Oh, sorry, not Alexander, Jekker. I get confused between the two. Jekker, getting rid of it. Couldn't get, couldn't get it out of it. Here's Strzok now. In Strzok at center. Gains the zone. The corner to the front. No one's there. Another chance. Rebound. Oh, no. no goal, my bad. Must have been a really good save. My goodness. Did he get it? Either it was a crease violation, a really good save, a dislodged goal. It still remains three to one. Well, I'll tell you guys, the day the Penguins are going to want to have that one back. Will there be a face-off coming up to the, oh, well, our right side of the net, the left side of the goalie. It wasn't a rebound either. It was just a pass to the middle. But I bet there's a good reason why that was waved off. So I'm not the one out there on the ice. 
And this faceoff won by Texas. Texas on the end of it. To the front. Six going out. And they're poking away at it. The defense gets to it first. Here's Butler. Dumping it off the referee. There's a shot off something. Brought down. Couldn't put it away. And this face-off will take place in the neutral zone. Face-off won by, I believe initially, the Penguins. It's being battled for. Warriors have it in their own zone. Find a man to the, find a man to the left side. Going in on him there. Going D to D with the Penguins. Here's Isa. Isa, in on side. There's a shot. Didn't get through. Couldn't keep it in. Now it's Desai with it. In his own zone, Desai looking to find someone to give it to under a bit of pressure. Gets it off his stick. Pass, almost found a man there. It goes to the corner. Dallas is first to the puck. Isa. I believe it's Isa at the point. Puck escapes the zone. He lost his footing. Brought down by the Warriors there. Off of, I believe, Philo's stick, and that one goes in in the Penguins' defensive zone. They'll chase after that dumping. Almost found a man there that they want to give it to, and we have an offside call. Win the draw. That's a clean win off the draw. One of their cleanest yet. Around the back. Didn't find anyone off of that one. Arm is up, and it'll be icing. It's probably been countless icing calls this game. I mean, it's not the most we've seen, but it's still quite a bit. Well, it's probably the most we've seen this season. I'll tell you that. Face off will take place at the left circle. If you're facing down there. Currently it's Ellis with it at center. Ellis in onside. There's a shot brought down there. Behind the net. To the top of the circle in the slot. He's shooting. That one didn't get through. Warriors getting rid of it. Just missed his man really. He was it went up and over the glass and out of play. You see me up over the Warriors bench and out of play, I should clarify. Tyler might be a bit of a lucky break for the Penguins. If that found its man, he would be gone. Nine thirteen to go in this third period of play. Score is three to one in favor of Dallas. He's plugging the circle. Now it's the Warriors with it. They get it out. Up in the air. Penguins have to get it set up now. Warriors, they gain the zone. Shot blocked. That's a good block shot. That's the save the goalie didn't have to make. It's a battle now. Bodies falling. Warriors are going to emerge off of it. Still, it's a battle in the corner. Penguins find it, and they get it out. Ellis. Pass. Quite a hard pass. They didn't find his man enough. Ellis. Trying to get the puck off his stick there, and the Warriors take it away. He's taking swings at him. No arms are up on that one. Puck is loose at center. Warriors have it. 
Well, dump and chase. The side. Two goals for hitting this game. And they both came from the point. Chance developing for the Warriors if they get a shot off. That shot was stopped off the pad of Riddle. The point. Out of play. So I didn't think the uh, stair frame was a part of the boards. <laughs> Binder lost the face off there initially, but he picks it back up. And Penguins take it. The corner of Warriors with it. We're going to get it out. At center. Jecker trying to find the man. And it's going to be a stoppage of play here. They're calling too many men. Sorry if my microphone's picking that up, but he is livid, it sounds like. It'll be a bench minor penalty against the Warriors. Pick somebody to put him in the box. Let's go. And finally pick the man to serve the bench minor. with Penguins power play. I believe all their goals have been off of power play so far. That's what I want to say. We'll see if they can pull off another power play goal. Here's this side. The side with it. Moving around toward the right side. Find a man. Oh, good cut out there. Neal's kept it in. Jecker to the side, to side, to Neal. Neal in the circle, shoots, missed the net. Jecker to side. Shooting one off his stick, and that is up over the glass and out of play. Face off in the neutral zone taken by the Penguins. Minute nine left in the penalty. There's a good chance there. Just went off something in the both the top. The side, the point. The side shooting. Oh, what a block shot. Oh, what a terrific job. He dropped down to the ice to make the play. Jumping out of the left side. Puts it back behind the net. They're still battling for it, back behind the net. He swings at each other, Jecker, down back behind the net. You cannot tell who that is. Binder trying to pick it up. The corner. I believe that's Schaefer on it. Trying to get a stick to it. Warriors going to get it out to Sai. To the right side. Neal. Waiting. Shoot. Save made. And he'll hold on. And those two going at it there. And it looks like, uh, it looks like they're going to get penalized for that. That's just a waste. I mean, you're wasting a good guy with that. 
Yes, emotions are high with this one. The being the playoffs, third period, three to one in favor of the Penguins with five seconds to go in the penalty. Um, get a look at that. But uh, it's still no excuse. There's a shot, just missed the net. Struck, going for one, didn't find the target. And the penalty is expired, five on five skating. Ooh, good keep in there. Top of the circle, couldn't find a man. Green kept it in. They find a man in the circle, waiting to the front and get to it. That was intended for the front there, but didn't find anyone. Warriors trying to find a man, couldn't. Now they get it back. 440 left in the third period. They need to get something going fast. They need to apply some pressure on their opponents as much as they can with them being down by two. It's loose. Now it's the Warriors in their attacking zone. Behind the net. Warriors first to the puck. Behind the net. Out of the corner. He's got it with him still. The point. Letting it go. Good block shot. Bernier. Only the keeper to beat. There's a shot. Save made. Warriors coming back on a counterattack if they can get a man. Pass to anyone. Good pressure there by the defense. Philo. Philo past the center line. Past the blue line. Philo with it in the corner. Couldn't pass it to anyone there. Warriors with it. And it's going to be a penalty coming up here. I would guess for probably a hooking penalty. It'll be a hook. We've got a hooking call here. Let's take a look at that one again. Well, you said it, buddy. I mean, he gave him a nice ride with a stick on that one. I mean, sometimes guys will just give a little yank on a stick to slow a player down, but that was more than just a little yank. Yeah, and usually you can get away with a hooking call, but when it's obvious, get ready to sit down. Warriors have an incredible chance to try and get back in this game as much as they can. Down by two, but on the power play. The last goal they scored was a power play goal. Let's see what they can do. Warriors at the top of the circle. Couldn't get a stick on that one. And the puck gets clear. Tyler won't be surprised if in just a little bit, I'll be surprised if the Warriors pull their goalie. Usually goalies get pulled with you know one or two goal deficits. Right now it's a two goal deficit. If they do get one on the board, if they make it three to two, it's highly probable they'll pull their goalie. A minute 11 to go on the penalty. Side, looking to kill off some time. Couldn't pass it to anyone. And the Penguins get it cleared down, looking to kill off some more time on the penalty. The clock is on their side. 47 seconds left in the 5 on 4. The Penguins get it back down into their attacking zone with the Warriors on it now. When they try and get it down and create as many chances as they can, but right now the Penguins are having none of it. Tyler, these Penguins, this Penguins team, they've been doing it. This is probably one of the best jobs they've done on the penalty kill so far in this game. Might be one of their best. Hope I'm not speaking too soon, though. Listen, we have 10 seconds left in the penalty. Currently, the Warriors have it at the top of the circle. There's a shot just past the post. To the front, no one was there, and the penalty is now over. Five on five skating. Offside is called. And the coincidental penalties are over now. Since they didn't appear up on the scoreboard, they have to be let out of the whistle. 
And I believe it's going to be a timeout. Warriors will use their timeout. So, they're being 3-1 to one in favor of the Penguins. A minute 21 to go in the third period and being full strength for both teams. Um, nice. Do you have any comments so far? Well, Ty, I won't be surprised if the Warriors pull their goalie. Down by two, they need to get something going quickly. They have to put as much pressure as they can on their opponents and try and get into their heads. For the Penguins, they have to stay strong at the defensive end and clear the puck as many times as they can. If not, if they have the chance, try to extend their lead. I mean, there's no, no harm or foul with that. Thomas, you got anything else? Well, Tyler, there's been quite a few penalties. I mean, might be a lot of work for you and the uh, editor. Well, my, it probably won't be the most for me, thankfully, but you do have a point there. It's been, it hasn't been the cleanest of games. But that, I believe we can verify that through sense data. That's been quite a number of penalties in this game. And the whistle blows to conclude timeout. There's a move yet, and off they go now. 121 to go in the third period. Ty, I think if they had the chance, they're going to pull the goalie. That's my guess. Cooper Neal getting set to take this face off for his team. Warriors win the draw. And the net is now empty on the other end. Six on five. Minute three. Shot save made by Riddle. Ty, if the Penguins can get an empty netter against a cure game one. So, the net is empty down there. Down by two. They have to get something going quickly. At the point, Warriors with it. There's a shot just past the post. To man in front, the defense get it away. No ice. Net remains empty. Penguins trying to get a stick on it. There's a shot just past the post. Escape there. 24 ticks left. Puck is loose. Warriors with it in the corner. Almost found a Penguins player. You got 11 ticks left on the clock. There's a shot. Into the glove of Riddle. And he'll hold on. Good glove save. That's going to keep him in this game. And in the lead, too. And this draw, letting it go, it goes past, and the Dallas Penguins will take game one. Seriously, for the Penguins, one nothing. All I have to do is win one more for this game, your final score. Texas Warriors one, Dallas Penguins three. The Penguins were able to put this one away and recover nicely. A two goal lead is always a good buffer, especially late in the third period. Uh, how, many, how do you think they did it? Well, Tyler, I think I wouldn't be surprised if some of the side practiced those shots from the point, but he showed what he could do and he delivered. As for the rest of the team, they did better defensively. I think they could do a little bit more on the chemistry side, but it is enough for them to take this one home, as they're already home, up by one game. Thing is now is they have to follow through. Anything else, homies? Tyler, I mean, it wasn't their best of games, but like I said, it is enough for them, and it will be one for them that's a lot better than last game, I think. 
thing is to them is that they cannot let up until you hear that final horn. And I think that was a mistake they made last game. This game, they didn't make that mistake. So, that's my comments. And that's where we're gonna have to leave you for today. It's been a pleasure here. On behalf of Thomas Rodia and all of our crew, I'm Tyler Presley, signing off to you from Plano, Texas. The Penguins take game one. They have to win one more game. If the Warriors win game two, then we'll go to one more game to decide it. So it's first to two, best out of three. Penguins win game one. Until game two, we'll see you then. And then we therefore wish you good night and candy bars.